Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Fiend Folio. We are jumping in again. Let's see, who do you want to play? Um, da -da 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 -da. I'm not quite sure actually. It's... Do you know what? Let's do a Tainted Lost run. It's been a little while since I've actually given Tainted Lost a good go. He's a lot of fun and he's a character that I actually really, really, really like. He tests your skill, although I will say the fact that I haven't played him properly in a long time means that I'm probably going to suck as him, but we give it an honest try. Honestly as well, Fiend Folio is pretty rough with this guy, especially the bosses, the Fiend Folio bosses, um, like, uh, I'm not quite sure which ones are the worst. There's a few of them that are pretty bad. Honestly, Spider Butt, not a bad first grab. I actually quite like Spider Butt. I do not mind it because we can get quite a lot of spiders out of it, as you just saw. It's not as good for the slowing effect, although the slowing effect is not to be underrated. It's it's still decent, but uh, it's really about getting the spiders. If we can keep all of these spiders for the boss, that'd be really nice. And then let's go, just go straight into the boss. Ooh, this is a really, really bad boss for us. Thank God we got rid of one of them already. Thank God there's this random pot here as well. We can just sit above it, because, yeah, these guys move at the fucking speed of sound. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, you've got to love it. Those guys move at the speed of sound. It's insane. But we got Mutant Spider here, which I'm not actually sure is a good thing just because of the low fire rate, but it should be pretty decent. The uh, shots are fairly grouped up. I don't know what happened there. I managed to kill an enemy underneath another enemy. Um, As for the... um. As for the question of the day, just because of that death that we just got there, what is your biggest skill issue? <laughs> what is your biggest thing, like, in gaming that you just can't even... I, I don't really know for me. I think mine is just general incompetence. <laughs> Basically, a lot of the time, I tend to just, like, not know things I should know. Or, I tend to know things and completely forget them. To the annoyance of many. Yeah, I do not like this little worm. Get gone. Yeah, to the annoyance of many, I, I tend to know things pretty well. And just forget to use the knowledge I have. Okay, you shouldn't be too bad. I'll put a bomb down there as well. Takes you out a little quicker. I'm going to try and take out the baby first, but it's not good. Actually, it, it, I was going to say I'm going to try. It's, it's literally not going to be possible at this point. I've done too much damage to the main body. It's okay, though. This guy shouldn't be too hard. There you go. And we get quality zero. Better item qualities, people. Better item qualities. Um, I will quickly go and check out my shop now that I've got this, though, because I might be able to grab an extra holy card. You never know with this guy. You never know. And I would like to try. Okay. You aren't so bad. I just, I love the fact that with this character, you get such a good start. You get spectral, you get flight, you get good stats. It's just really nice. Makes this character feel way more fun to play off the get-go. Off the first few floors. Um, unfortunately, we didn't. We did, however, get a deck of cards, which would be a fantastic, fantastic thing to pick up. But we have absolutely no way of affording it right now. Now, there is one way we could afford it. It's by finding our secret room. But I have to admit, I am completely unsure as to where the secret room might be. I think it's here. It's not there. Okay, we're out of luck. We're out of luck. We're out of luck. Do, 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 do. And we're out of luck. We're out of luck. Anyways. I'm in a good mood, as you can probably tell by the horrible singing. Um, but yeah, let's let's just continue on. Play the best that we can. Kill the enemies that are high priority. Like these poop-flinging bastards. Anything that can launch tears from above, they need to go now. Also, you need to go as well. You're spawning. You're basically spawning lag. Could you stop, sir? Oh my god, I can't kill this guy. And then you manage to spawn a spider as well. Among all the mini spiders. My goodness. Excuse me. Check in here. Ooh. I don't actually know how this works as this guy. The jewel uh, removes the negative effect of using sinful jewel if it had one. What the fuck is that? I have no idea what that means. Um, I think I'm going to go for this. I think I can do this for free as this character. No, I can't. Okay, it doesn't matter. I thought as this character you'd get the um, the good grace of being able to use that for free. But um, Pedroff is a bastard man. And he will not allow it. 
Big sad. Nah, I'm, I'm sure there'll be some stuff like that that changes with the big update. Ipecac's got a very, very big update in the works uh, that's changing a lot of things, respriting stuff, adding new stuff. Really excited for it, but it has absolutely no ETA right now, um, but it's likely to be a, a quite a while away, probably another few months, uh, because it's it's a big one. And honestly, it's a small dev team and they don't have a ton of time to work on the mod, um, just in the mix of personal life, obviously holidays and stuff like that, which I do not blame them for at all. That's completely reasonable. Ooh, Mulligan. Very nice. Also, uh, we got an upgraded penny there from our... Uh, Sleight of hand. I really like sleight of hand. It's very good. But yeah, mulligan, pretty good. Although I will say with mulligan, I don't know how it scales with quad shot. Because you, you get a chance to fire a fly for every time you shoot. But does does it count as firing four shots or does it count as firing once when I fire? Because with quad shot, it might be that the mulligan is pretty bad um, with the setup that we've got right now. Oh, that was pretty nice. Managed to charm that guy into killing all those enemies. Uh, or it could be the case that because we're firing four tiers at once, it's pretty good. I'm, I'm really not sure. Um, slots and beggars animate faster spawn three pickups around Isaac when first picking up. I mean, we might as well pick it up first at least. Why not? Um, we should go to our shop, really. We have the money to, to get something out of it. I just wish we had this money last floor. Gosh darn it. Right make our way back. But yeah, I do love a good Tainted Lost run. Very fun character. Getting this guy uh, all the completion marks for Dead God was was kind of insane. Um, King Baby does have... Uh, he is he is like buffed. We also got the... Um, the Scrying Stone, which is interesting, but we don't get that many Soul Stones. I'm going to take King Baby um, and hope for the best for King Baby. I'll also bomb these two, because why not? That was pretty lucrative. Uh, we almost got enough for the stern as well, if we want to try and get it. Um, yeah, I think King Baby can shoot on his own now. Yeah, he can. Okay, nice. It's not a ton of shots, but it's nice. It's, it's a little bonus. There you go. Let's get the stern as well, because why not? It might not be that useful to us. But we'll give it a go. Will, does it spawn while I'm pick up? Unfortunately, it doesn't. I kind of wish that it did. Um, but yeah, any, any um, rune stones, including soul stones, I believe have um, some bonus effects, or some doubled effects, which is pretty nice. That's going to be pretty useful. I like the way our character looks with these, like, hollow blue eyes. That's pretty cool. Okay, stay over the rocks with these ghosts around. Quit. Get out of here, you. Get out of here. Let's see if we can get ourselves a penny out of these. Yeah. There's a little bit of slowing for the boss fight. It's not, it's not an insane help, but it will be a help. Okay, this guy shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, basically while we're holding down fire, King Baby will shoot at things for us. It's pretty nice. The stapler is lovely for us here. Nice damage boost. And then from here, we get Mum's Knife, which is really, really good. Come on, Mum's Hand. Just, just stop be taking the piss, please. Um... Devil's Tooth, yeah, let's, let's just take the Mum's Knife here. Pretty nice. Although I will say, I haven't used Mum's Knife in quite a while, and with Quad Shot, the charge is abhorrent. The charge on it is terrible. So, it's going to be a little bit tough to use. We're going to need some fire rate bonuses to make this work. Otherwise, we're going to have to get extremely close to enemies, or um, basically hang out over rocks to actually charge it. Slightly annoying enemy here, but he shouldn't be alive for too long. There you go. Yeah, we're just going to have to be very cautious about how we enter rooms and how we charge things. Honestly, King Baby, doing a good job for us right now. I love you, buddy. Yeah, just because the range is obviously directly tied to um, to the, char the amount of charge. And considering it charges so, so slow, our range on this thing is very limited. Meaning we're going to have to get even closer to enemies to take them out. Not exactly the ideal way to play this character now, is it? Now, the good thing is we can kind of do this with enemies that aren't as big of a threat in terms of, like, shooting us. We can just kind of perk them. Also, another thing to note is that with Mum's Knife, the, the knives actually do more damage the further away they are from your body. So... You're not going to be getting quite as much damage by keeping them close. But honestly, having four knives m means it shouldn't really matter. Extra bit of stuff there. 
Good, good, good. We got an extra bomb in that room there. I can come back for it though. Okay, boss room's right here. They're the situations that we want to see. But yeah, I'm probably going to have my fingers aching by the end of this run. Thank you, King Baby. Honestly, King Baby's doing a lot of damage for us right now. I respect it. I'm sure to go in here and kill the boss straight away. Thank you. Get perfection. Kind of makes sense to get perfection before we do the rest of the floor. Just so we can uh, get a few more chests or whatnot, a few more room drops. We like to see it. We like to party. We, we, we like to party. Anyways, let's go try and find our item room. But yes, interesting run so far. Damage-wise, we are set. This is an enemy that I do not like the idea of at all. Um, Blockoma. Um, I mean, I guess. Sad sadly, some of the item quality increases haven't been so good here. Dude, that was such a dumb play. I, I, saw, the I saw the pin pop up and I just panicked. And I just went for the hit. Not a good idea at all. Forget what you guys do. Um, I should probably go to the shop and look for a holy card real quick. That was very dumb of me. Very dumb of me indeed. I just panicked. No holy card, but there is red stew. Which I'd very much like if we can get it. But I'm having a feeling that's not going to happen. Right, let's do the rest of the rooms just because we've got... Um, We've got the ability to get quite a lot more drops out of this. Ooh, I do not like you exploding near me. Go away. Thank you. Right, just hope we get as many chest drops at the end of the rooms as we can. Okay, nice. I'll bomb these and see if we get anything. Fortunately not. We only need four more coins. That's... that's, that's not a lot. Okay, nice. Ooh, we got a golden sack. That could that could pay dividends. That could be really good. 25%. Oh, it's a 12% chance to disappear. So far, so good. But didn't get much money out of it, unfortunately. A lot of bombs, though. I like that. I think this might be secret room below us here. Let's try that out. Nice. We got Found Soul, which unfortunately isn't quite as good. Oh, no way. That would have been the money that we needed. That would have been it. I can't even remember what item we're trying to get right now. I'm just... I just want it. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, th these tears lingering for this long is not good for our health at all. Come on, we're so close, game. Just give me the pennies I need. We're so close. What else can we bomb slash whatever to get some more money here? Sacrifice takes two tokens. Okay, we don't have anywhere near enough tokens to make that work. Don't worry about it. We could try and look for second secret room. We have enough bombs. Right. Come on, poop. Pay out, please. Damn you. <laughs> hey, we found it. Nice. <gasps> A fool's gold rock. Yes. We did it. I don't really care about those cards, I'll be honest. Right. Let's go back and buy whatever the item is that I was looking to buy that I legitimately cannot remember what it was at all. See, I have the memory of a goldfish. I can't do it. My brain. It's too small. Right, what was it? Oh, it was red stew. Okay. Red stew, very nice. Al although red stew isn't the best thing for us, it is pretty darn good. It will keep us going damage-wise for the next probably two floors. Um, the only thing is, to keep it going, we have to be quick. And being quick isn't really in our wheelhouse with this character. We we don't have high speed, and we have to do some very long charge ups to actually get our knife to uh to hit things. So eh, 
Not the best idea, but hey ho. The rooms like this. I don't know if King Baby gets affected by our damage. I would assume not. That was close. Excuse me. <clears throat> we have a lot of keys right now. I gotta remember I don't have a holy card right now. I'll just take this. I don't care. Gideon's gear is pretty darn good. Gideon's gear is gonna remove all um what 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 are they called? All the um grimaces in the game. Let's quickly check for a holy card. Damn it, I was not expecting a fight here. We did, however, get Steam Sale, which is potentially kind of good. Okay. Run away with the stress. Playing no holy card is, like, it's just... The problem with it is, like, I feel like I'm good enough to not get hit in most scenarios, especially with this setup. But the issue is that I don't think the game is kind enough to not bullshit hit me with something. There's just so, so much of a chance of some BS happening, some BS occurring and hitting me. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't really rate my chances right now. I need that holy card as that little bit of protection from the BS, because this game just has so plentiful amounts of it. Damn it. Okay, thank you for uh, getting that, get that dude, King Baby. I think King Baby is scaling up my damage, you know. Feels like it. Right, this would have to be a really good item. Ah, uh, okay, we don't know what it is, of course. If I get a holy card, I'll come back and do that. Otherwise, I'm not, because it could spawn bosses that I'm just not ready for. Getting our consumable gain going, though. We can go back to our shop if we want. Oh, no, no there was nothing in our shop, was there? I remember now. Mulligan is, is really popping off right now with um, this setup. The flies that we're spawning are just de dealing such insane amounts of damage. Okay, don't get near those guys. Might as well pop the fool's gold rock. Having the glass spin down as well is pretty nice for later on. Obviously, this floor is going to be useless, but later down the line, it could end up being pretty good. We're getting pretty good rooms to be able to clear quickly. I will say that. Wow, the damage. Beautiful. Tears up is fantastic here. I have no idea what I'm grabbing at this point. Of all of those, honestly, that one was not bad. Enraged Soul, I won't use it much, but it's not it's not actively bad for me, so I don't really mind. We got the Labyrinth here. Okay, careful, because this guy has a, a raining effect. Those are the enemies we need to be really careful of. Good. Pills I'm not going to mess with right now. A hey, Gideon's Gear is going to take that guy away. Thank you. Bump, 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 bump. This song from this floor gets stuck in my head so much. I'll be sat on my PC and I'll just feel like doing... Duh, 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 and I have no idea where it's from. And I'm like, oh shit, it's the fucking Isaac thing from the Dank Depths. So many pills go away with all the- Oh! I thought... Dormimics couldn't spawn as Tainted Lost. I I thought I remembered having a discussion about it being way too evil to have them spawn as Tainted Lost. Apparently I was very incorrect. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I, I like, if you look at the minimap, I saw the room and I went to walk in it and I realized like a millisecond before that it was a Dom Mick, but I, my, my momentum carried me through the door, got me killed. Beautiful. Beautiful agony. Wow. That is just depression. It is just depression. My god, that run was going so well. I mean, I didn't have a, t I didn't have a holy card, which was definitely a huge downer. But that run was actually going reasonably well. 
Big, sad, big, sad. Do you know fucking Pedroff? He's going to love that shit. He's going to be reveling in that. My god, he's going to find that hilarious. You evil bastard. Wait a minute. Before you take up the coins. Okay. I had to check if I got counterfeit penny from the other one before I picked up the coins from this one. Just in case. Um, That's actually pretty decent. Um, It gives us a bit of bonus luck early before we get perfection. I don't know what these enemies do. I'm going to guess they explode. Okay, they don't explode. Good to know. But... I like the way it's just a medal that covers your eye. Slightly harder boss here. Just because of that. He can literally telefrag you now, so... Gotta be really careful. And, and I do mean telefrag too. He can teleport, like, directly behind you. Most of the time he teleports to the other end of the room. I think they've put some protection on it to make sure that doesn't happen often. But it can happen. I've had it happen a few times. Especially once they're split. Once they're split, things become way more complicated. Okay, nice. Little Steven, honestly not a bad grab early on. Okay, we rebuild. We rebuild. We, we start again. Divorce papers for a tears up. Very, very good. And a trinket that we do. This is a very bad boss for us, though. Just because of the sheer amount of dips that this guy can spawn. Although the dips will spawn these little slippy heart things that can deal a good amount of poison damage. So that's not terrible. It's just the, the fucking velocity at which you can throw out these little poop babies. And this guy. This guy can go suck a fucking egg. I guarantee I get hit by this dude. Actually, oh, his health isn't too bad, but I'm not going to say it can't happen. Oh, my God. <laughs> what the fuck was that little fly doing? He was dead. <laughs> fucking told you I'd get hit by him. Magic skin. Thank you. <laughs> I fucking told you. He's just a shithead. I hate that boss. Design him different. It's not fun. <laughs> I don't- I, I'm actually fine with most of his attacks. It's the fucking little guys I don't like. Get them off my screen. It's same with Buster in, um, the ghost dude. Is it Buster? Ghost Buster, whatever his name is. The- 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 that- the- the, blah, 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 blah. That version of him that appears on Downpour. Get rid of the little fucking ghosts. They're such a pain in the ass. We're back to square one again, though. Onsel shot doesn't really do much for us. Secret room. Do we know where that is yet? We've got a lot of poison-based things going on right now. The only thing I don't like about tonsils is the visual effect is just strange. It just looks so bizarre. Gimme, gimme. Yeah, I don't know where secret room is right now. These enemies are going to be kind of annoying. Extension cable? Probably better right now. Not going to be super good with just one familiar, but I will take it. i got to check the shop. Keeper's sack? Why are some things costing only 10 now? The placebo costs only 10. I'm not quite sure why that is. Right. Secret room, reveal yourself to me. I thought it makes a little chicken noise whenever we spawn one of those clouds. The amount of poison we've got is very high. I mean, it could technically be here, just below us. Let's just check. Yep, that checks out, and... That checks out, yeah, it's probably here. we get experience bar, not a bad item to get early on. We get a holy card, thank goodness. We smelt a random trinket onto ourselves. Grabby hands, which I'm not exactly sure what they do, but... Probably not going to be great. But with extension cable, it seems pretty good. Gain the effect of Kapala for the room. I don't know what that item does, so I don't want its effect, I'll be honest. Um, also, let's just go blank and then do that. 
So these guys are going to be annoying as fuck, but with extension cable, I think they're actually pretty damn good. <laughs> Because they're just creating electricity across the entire room. Now, I've got to see what they end up doing to a boss first. They can grab me. No. This is so bad. They can grab me. I didn't know they could grab me. Fuck, this is going to be terrible. <laughs> this is going to be so awful. Damocles, very nice. Let's get out of here. Yeah, this is going to be fucking awful awful. <laughs> this is not going to be good at all. They're going to end up getting me killed. I know it. But Damocles is really good grab. Um, if we can stay alive, Damocles will be very good. Experience bar is also really good to get it so early. It means we should be able to get quite a lot of stats out of it. But yeah, as there's literally no downside to Damocles as his character, so for oh, fuck's sake, stop grabbing me. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be so frustrating. I kind of love it. It's it's a really dumb challenge. Oh, dude, what the hell? Why the hell did that guy move like that? The, the, just, another thing that I even think about is the visual clutter that's going on on screen with all the little turd clouds, the tonsils, the electricity, the hands. There's just so much going on. It's very hard to keep track of what's... What's enemy and what's not. Very hard to keep track indeed. Let's just do the boss now. I don't know. I do not understand this boss. Did that bomb even hit him? Okay, we got him. Good. He spawned enemies right at the end of his thingy. Do I actually want perfection or do I want to keep this? Definitely good here. I don't know. I kind of want to keep... I kind of want to keep my electricity, but it is very visually distracting. But at the same time, I'm going to keep it. I think it's cool. Perfection's really good, but yeah, I think this is cool. Especially considering I think when it actually grabs the enemy, it's also dealing the electricity damage. He's Mascara, while not particularly good for us right now, is pretty good in general. Demon Baby, another familiar. Um, one closer to Conjoined, I like that. Shop time. Um, options could be pretty good, I guess. <laughs> Honestly, let's take, let's take Magic Fingers, though, instead. Because it means that if there's basically a bad looking room, we've got a get out of jail free card if we've got enough money. Oh my god, leave go of me. You shitheads. Right, let's get out of here. Get off me. <laughs> As if it fucking randomly smelted this trinket to me. It's why I love that soul stone so much. It can create some really funky interactions. I would have never picked this up normally. Get off me. <laughs> oh my god, leave me alone. Fucking, ah! Uh, it's so hard to dodge them. I can't remember, does the electricity scale with our damage at all? Or is it just static? I'm, I'm going to imagine it's pretty static. Okay, these are, th those enemies are, um, herming ones. I want rid of them. Basically, if we see a room that we think is going to be really hard, we just get rid of it. We level up again, get a bunch of stats. No, thank you. Careful, these guys fire a volley of shots. Another heart container thingy. Yeah, this is actually a really strong run. That's the thing. This, this run has a lot of positives. No, 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 no. Okay, actually, let's try and save our magic fingers for whenever we get grabbed. If we get grabbed and we're in a situation where it's looking bad, just spam magic fingers a few times. I think that's probably the best way to use it right now. The more money we can get to fund it, the better. The only thing we want to be buying really is really good items. Items that are going to give us more money in the in the long run. Or, um... Oh god, this is a bad version of him to be fighting. It's okay, we got him. Um, or uh, holy cards. That's both of these are really good for us. Thank you. 
Okay, get off my penny. <laughs> you little shits. Oh my god. This is hilarious. Petrified poop. I just love the way they grab, like, random shit and just, like, fucking carry it off. <laughs> oh, there is two items there. I didn't realise. Nah, we don't, we don't care about either of those, really. We will check our shops just in case, but there's not much I, I'm going to want, I don't think. Nah, don't want either of those. Right, let's get gone. We don't need to full clear the floors anymore either because we don't have perfection anymore, so we're not gaining too much out of it. Of course, we could miss small things like a planetarium or a 1% chance or whatever, but I'm just going to stick with what I know, keep going, see how long we can carry this on for. <laughs> Golden chests could be pretty good, although I'll hold off for now. The little chicken noises, whatever they are, whatever they are I love it. Don't know what these enemies do. Can't remember. Okay, they do. They do the jumps. Did that thing just grab a grimace? What do you think was going to happen there, my good sir? Ooh, that's a reflected. I can't remember. Oh no, reflecteds can't kill the lost, but they do break your holy mantle, which I think is dumb. Um, so just remember that they can't kill you, but they do break your holy mantle. This guy fires explosives, I want him dead. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so stressful. There's genuinely just so much additional stress. Um, The wasp could be good, but I, I really would rather keep as much money as I possibly can. A golden heart. Hey, get off me hand. We want as much safety as we can possibly get. Any room that looks like it's going to be tricky. Or if we get grabbed like that. Just pop your space bar to sort of get out of trouble. That's also a very good trinket there. But it is not the electricity that we need. That we want should I say. We don't need it. Yeah, like, rooms like that are just, like, insta-get rid of. Even just doing that and weakening a room is pretty, pretty valuable. Right, check this out. I think that's an all stats up. F you made me buy the sack, you fucking shithead! <laughs> I'm gonna take that, that's pretty good. I can't believe that, it dragged me directly into the sack. Which sounds like it's dragging me to bed, so I'm not going to say that again. Is there a Lego man up there? What the hell? Fucking get off me! <laughs> oh my god. The frustration. I can't remember. Does um does this Magic Fingers item give you more... I can't remember. Does it give you more um damage the more coins that you hold? Very nice. And pretty good. Fucking okay, don't grab me into anything again, you shithead. My goodness. The frustration here <laughs> is very large. I like the booster pack. Um, strength. No. You don't really care about any of that. The strength card is probably... No! It grabbed me at the worst time again. I need more money now. I've, I've kind of run myself quite low here. He grabbed me while, the, while I'm fighting the boss. Don't grab me while I'm fighting a boss, please. Grab the boss. I'm, I'm fine with you grabbing the boss. But not me. Fucking don't drag me down the hole, you shit. <laughs> I think I'm just going to go for that. 
Get me out of here. Right, I took Guppy's Pride because it's yet another thing for the extension cable to be good with. My god. This has been stressful. Both of these are really good. Flyboy, unfortunately, is still glitched, but it's it's good in itself. I'm going to take them both. While Flyboy isn't great, because it can cause some extra lag, I might get rid of it later on. It's, it depends how bad my lag ends up being, but it does give you a good amount of damage. Fucking get off me! Oh my god! The frustration today is large. Large and in charge. Get off me! Fuck's sake! For grabbing me straight into enemies, you shitheads! Oh my god. It's just so hard to pay attention to where the hands are. Spare holy card. Yes, please. That is a miracle for us. It's so, so, so very good. In case I walk into another door mimic or whatnot. Fucking hell. Stress. The stress levels right now are through the roof. Through the damn roof, I tell you. Get off me. I won't say it again. Very, very good. All the kind of wish I'd have taken thingy now. Uh, piercing tears increase damage for every monster they pass through. That's that's decent. Um, yeah, kind of wish I'd have taken thingy now. Um, deep pockets is potentially really good. We'll try and buy that. Um, yeah. Chili, the chili would have been better to have more luck with, but it is what it is. Still gonna fire a reasonable amount of them. Get off me, you fucking shit! You're grabbing an empty chest there, you realise that, right? Ooh, we got one of these machines. I kind of would like to play that, but... Okay, we can play this four times. One, two, three, four. Thank you. A little bit of extra money. Lovely. Ooh, how does this work with this character? Does it does it work? Wait a minute. Let me just quickly drop it and see if it says. Um, gives you one MC coin heart container. It is depleted before any of your normal hearts could only be refilled directly using money. Let me try this. I don't think it works as this character. By the looks of it, it's not giving me the UI for it. Nah, the UI isn't popping up. I'm pretty sure they made sure it doesn't work as this character. Let's go get deep pockets. Just a re renewable way of getting money back. Oh my god. This piercing thing seems, sounds pretty good though. If we, pa if we get piercing and if it passes through an enemy, the next enemy it hits, it uh, does more damage to. I like that idea. Get off me again. See more money. That's what we like to see. Okay, we might have to remove Flyboy. It's actually lagging the game quite a lot. I wish it wasn't so. That's just the way it is right now. Got another level up. More stats. Good, good. Dun, dun, dun. It's... Get off me. Dude, oh my god, he almost dragged me straight into that enemy. I would have absolutely fucking killed you if you'd done that. My goodness, these hands. This run was a fucking meme. 
An absolute meme of a run. I feel like they could be really problematic on this fight, so I've got to be careful. Good, good. We get, um... Gulp trinkets. I'd, I'd rather take the Cat and Nine Tails, I'll be honest. And then we'll take the Polaroid here. I guess I'll check this out, but there's very little chance that I'm going to want to take whatever's in here. Honestly, there isn't even anything that good. Only $3 bill is really worth taking there. I'm not going to bother with any of that shit. Oh my god. <sighs> Didn't know a run could be this much stress. Get off me. Every time I enter a room, you're there to fuck me up. I should actually use this in case it spawns um, some special hearts. Wow. It spawned three morbid hearts. That's insane. Unless I have an item that boosts their chance, which I don't think I do. That's kind of crazy. Yeah, we just want as much money as possible to make um, magic... Not magic skin. You know, what, you know what I mean. Magic fingers as good as possible. Get the fuck off me. Problem is, there's a lot of enemies on this floor that I don't recognize very much. They're going to cause issues. Any enemies that I don't really know their attack patterns are going to be the ones that cause me the most pain, I think. Nah, not really worth it. We have a spare holy card, so at the minute I'm pretty happy with what I've got. Now this is a very annoying boss, but we should kill him pretty quick. Luckily we did. We get ourselves Synth Oil. Um, I'm pretty sure this is good for us. I'm pretty sure this will be... Yeah, this will net positive damage-wise. Uh, we'll... Ooh, wait. My Shadow. Isn't my Shadow fantastic now? This is tricky. I'm going to take this, because I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it's really good now. Like, this little Shadow follows behind you, and if the Shadow touches enemies, it spawns charges, which deal ridiculous damage. Now, it's a little hard to use as this character, I will admit, but I think it's better. Um... That's really good. Okay, his feet still came down, which is scary to me. I didn't expect that. I don't really know what's going on with this boss right now. I think he's dead. But yeah, that item that we just got, really good. When we enter a room, enemies are frozen for almost a second. That's super, super useful. Like, insanely useful. Just being able to get a lay of the land a little bit before the room actually kicks off is is potentially insane. I see that Dom Mick there. I'm not falling for you again, Mr. Fucker. Not this time, you shit. Like, rooms like this, we can even take advantage of early by um, using our magic fingers to kill. Because the, if the room looks, like, scary, we can just be like, nah, I'm not playing that. Yeah, if a room ever looks a bit too scary, we can just get rid. I just want your money. Probably should play the key beggar, but oh well. Don't like what's going on here. What the hell is going on here? Okay, thank you. Bad room. Get rid. Oh shit, there's clickety clacks. I didn't realize there was clickety clacks in this room. Get off me! You fuckers! <laughs> Stop touching me! I don't appreciate the touches. Oh, damn, the fires we shoot out are so big. Get, get off me! The hands are going to be the fucking death of me in this room. They're going to drag me straight into, um... Straight into one of her tears, aren't they? Oh, no, they both grab them to her. Nice. Devil deal. It's Krampus. 
Azazel's rage is decent. Krampus's head is not that great for us right now. Fuck me, this has been a stressful run. Get the fuck off me. The anger that I hold within my body, within my soul right now, is unfathomable. Wow, that is a that is a horrible looking room right there. Okay. Ah, stop touching me. Oh, these things don't need to die, okay. Oh, balls! I just lost a holy card. I didn't realize. Okay, Azazel's Rage might not have been a good idea. I kind of messed me up there. I wasn't paying attention. I didn't realize there'd be lasers coming down on me. Oh, fuck. I've been trapped. Okay, I lost a holy card there. Not good. We do not have a spare anymore. I'm not happy about that. Penny back. Oh, we can't even use magic fingers while this is firing either, I don't think. Oh, wait, no, we can. It just doesn't do the animation. It actually did fire. Strength, I might as well take at this point. My pennies back. Yeah, honestly, this is Azazel's Rage was not a good pickup. It's not very useful. No spiders, please. That's a Dominic to the left. I see it. Get off! What's wrong with the chest? Nice. Get off. If you'd have pulled me into that void portal, then I'd have fucking destroyed you. Very good. Uh, um. I guess. Triple Shot is a no from me. Camo Undies is incredibly good. Euthanasia is really good. I'll take this. Actually, I don't know. Do I want to take this? Wait. Oh, I've got that mod. I've got that mod. Okay. I was like, I think I've got the mod that lets me just take my active item again. I do. Okay. Proptosis, while annoying, is going to be really good for us because we can just deal insane damage now. Okay, that was pretty good. Our damage is crazy. The only problem right now is our visibility sucks. Big, fat, stinky cat dookie. Our visibility is really poor. That's going to be problematic. I mean, the damage that we're outputting though, especially with Proptosis on top, is nutty. Very nice. I don't think we need that. Although, we've got a lot of range. Let's go for it. I really hope we go the right way here. Oh, ho, ho, ho. the grabber familiar as well. No, thank you. I, I have absolutely no idea what the game wants from me in this room.
My god. Oh my goodness, we did it. Holy shit, what a fun run. That was hilarious. I hope you guys enjoyed that one, and I'll see you guys in the next one.